Here we go. The Hudsonville Eagles came in at 8-3, looking for their first regional crown since 2005. The Brighton Bulldogs, 9-2, also haven't been in a semifinal game in 14 years. One of these two had to come out on top. Only two other Livingston County teams in history have reached the semifinals. Brighton in 05, Fowlerville in 06. Dogs want to get there. Senior quarterback Colby Newberg fakes the give, keeps it himself. Watch him go. Bouncing off tacklers, 33 yards to the house. Bulldogs up 7-zip. After intercepting Hudsonville here, first play, Newberg throws a lateral to Ruben Salinas. He'll fire to a wide open Luke Stanton. He gone, 63 yards, Brighton up 21-0 after the first quarter. Hudsonville not out of it though. Backup QB Brennan Hayes in, lost one up for Brayden Vredeveld, somehow able to snare it, 21-7 Bulldogs at the break. Third quarter now, and Hudsonville's Hayes ready to rock and fire. He'll find a wide open Vredeveld, 46 yard scoring strike. Eagles within striking distance, 21 14. Fourth quarter now, Bulldogs trying to put this one away. Newberg fakes a handoff, keeps it himself, finds some room to the outside, pushed out at the one. No worries, he'll take it in himself. Colby carried it 15 times for 139 yards and two scores. 28-14 game. But here come the Eagles again. Hayes finds a new target this time. It's Carson Fisher coming down with the jump ball. Miss PAT kept it 28-20, but the Bulldogs did strike again, and that was all she wrote. Brighton heading to the semifinals for the first time in 14 years, beating Hudsonville 35-20. Bulldogs now one win away from becoming the first ever Livingston County football team to reach the state final.